What's up, you guys? This is Karmic and Dean's 1010, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangel, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current ancestor message. For the collective, please give me clear and accurate ancestor messages for the collective. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate you guys. All right. All right, let's see. Current energy. Current ancestor messages for the collective. Let's see. All right, so we have great mystery. We have trust, vision quest, what else? All right, we have freedom, okay. We have east. We have respect your physical body, detox, rejuvenate, relax. And we have knowing stone people. And we have take time out. All right. Recharge, rest. All right. Excuse me. So for some of you guys, I'm hearing for some of you guys, your ancestors want you to go more with the flow. Okay. That's the energy I'm feeling with this. Going more with the flow. I'm hearing you guys are going to find out some kind of information okay it's something that you're gonna you're gonna find out some kind of like information that's gonna make you feel free okay it's gonna make you feel free it's gonna make you feel more relaxed when it comes to like situations that you're going through is what i'm hearing okay it's like you're going to receive some information and I'm hearing somebody say, man, you know what? That just really made me feel like more relaxed. That makes more sense or that makes sense. Or it's like you're going to, it's something that, some kind of information you're going to receive and you're just going to feel like it's going to relieve you. Okay. It's going to make you like go more with the flow. Okay. You're just going to be chilling. I don't know. Like, <laughs> all right. All right, let's see. Current energy. So I'm hearing, it's like you're seeking for some kind of answer for something. And you're going to find it, but I feel like when you find it, it's just going to, you're going to feel so good. Like, man, like that really like, hmm. Yeah, make plans and focus. All right, trust your talents in changing times. That's what I'm saying. Because it's something with a talent that you have. And I feel like that somebody is going to help unlock that for you. It's like somebody is going to like give you some kind of information. And you're going to be like, ah, yeah, meditate and contemplate. Current energy. I mean, you could be even going up under like like a mentor or something like that for some of y'all. This could be like a mentor. Your commitment is being tested. Take care of your needs. So for some of you guys, your ancestors are testing you when it comes to like you putting yourself first and really taking care of the things that you have to take care of. Okay? It's not saying that you have to be selfish, but it's like, you know, put yourself first. So for some of you guys, you could be being tested about really putting yourself first. Okay? In a situation. Alright? So for some of you guys, you could be really getting tested with that. Alright, so let's see. What else is the collective being tested about, Spirit? Let's see. 
What else? Let's see. Commitment being tested. Let's see. Knight of Cups. Okay, so there's an offer coming towards you. All right? From somebody here. And it's like, whoever this person is, your commitment is being tested with this person. This person was sent to test you. Yeah, five of pentacles. Three of cups. Because whoever this person is, this person is going to come towards you like they this and they that and all this other, okay? But this person is really the five of pentacles on an energetic level. So somebody is going to try to like trick you is what I'm hearing. And your commitment is being tested with this person to see beyond the veil. Okay? Because this person is going to show up one way and they're not the way that they're going to show up as. Okay? This person may even tell you that they single and they not. This person got a whole situation going on in the background. If this got something to do with a relationship, this person is going to be lying. For some of y'all, this is going to be a very professional individual that's going to come towards you. Okay? For some of you guys, this is somebody that's going to ask you out on a date. And you better not have sex with this person because this person is carrying something with the five of pentacles. This person carrying some kind of STD. For some of y'all, this person is going to come ask you out on a date okay or come towards you and this is going to be a very professional looking individual all right and you are going to be tested to look beyond the veil because this person messes around with third party situations they travel and this person could do like third parties this person could do a lot of threesomes and stuff like that when they travel to different states and stuff so it's like your commitment is being tested with seeing beyond the veil with this person because for some of y'all, this is somebody that's going to come towards you with some kind of offer. And it's not going to be, it's going to turn out to be like, no. Okay. All right. Also, I'm seeing somebody like fill out for a job and don't get it. Okay. Yeah. And I'm seeing somebody be very upset about that. Because it's something that didn't go through that they wanted. Okay. So if you filled out for some kind of job or something like that and you didn't get it. Your commitment is being tested about what you do next. Are you going to go back into doing things that you let go of? Or are you going to continue trying to go the route that your ancestors and guides are leading you? So that's also what I'm hearing for somebody. Like, which route is you going to take? What you going to do? Because your commitment being tested right now about the choices that you make. A lot of times, we manifest things and your ancestors and spirit guides want to make sure you are ready for what you're manifesting. So, majority of the time, you get tested right before the manifestation comes into fruition. Just to make sure you are ready for this manifestation to be fulfilled, okay? So it's like, for some, at some times, you know, if you fail the test, it doesn't mean that you're not going to get something. It just means that it's a delay on it until you learn what you need to learn. And once you learn what you need to learn, then you will release, you know, that, you know, that manifestation of, you know, come through then. All right, because you learned what needed to be. You learned everything. You learned that, you know, specific lesson. You passed that specific test, okay? But just because you don't pass a test doesn't mean that it's just all bad. It just means, okay, there's a delay, okay? There's a delay, but it doesn't mean that you're not going to get it. It's just not right now. It's not where we were going to put it at if you were ready, you know, this is going to be delayed for a while, okay? Until we feel like you are fully ready, okay? Okay. So with this, something to do with a Libra, Aquarius, 
a Taurus, a Cancer, Scorpio, or something like that feeling. All right. You got Pisces here, too. Yeah, we got Metamorphosis, Butterfly. Pay attention to the areas in your life or personality that are in need of profound change or transformation. You are about to enter a phase of expansion and growth, which will be highly beneficial for your future. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, you are going through a metamorphosis at this time. Okay, like a real metamorphosis. Gentleness. This is a reminder to be more gentle with yourself and others. The grace, sensitivity, and gentleness of the spirit animal echo the qualities brought forth when living from the heart. Okay? So be more gentle with yourself. Don't be so hard on yourself and others. Okay? I mean, for a lot of you guys, that's easier said than done. Okay? And that's okay. You feel me? But it's just saying, like, be gentle with yourself and others. Okay? All right, yeah. So there could be some drama going on in the situation. All right. Current energy. Yeah, there could be some drama going on around because you're getting justice in your situation. Yeah, we have peace. So your past on loved ones want you to have peace. Somebody could be trying to disturb your peace, but they ain't going to be able to. Yeah, because you see that, your ancestors is right here. Okay, they're right there. Yeah, we got perception and self-preservation. And we have innocent. Okay? So, it's like your ancestors are here to make sure you have peace in your situation. They are here to make sure you have peace. And for a lot of you guys, it's like your ancestors want you to make sure that you are putting in the proper love into yourself that you put into others. Okay? So your ancestors don't want you... They don't want you shorting yourself just to put more into others that, you know, they don't deserve all that. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah. Mm-hmm. So you have some talents that your ancestors are going to like make you aware of okay current energy what else yeah spring autumn what else reflection akashic library yeah, because whatever this is, it's like you're going into like, for some of you guys, this is like a new gift that's that's coming out. For some of you guys, by the spring, there's going to be some kind of gift that you're going to realize that you have and it's going to put you at peace, I'm telling you. Yeah, King of Strolls, yeah, it's going to make something happen really quick for you. Yeah, it's something you're going to realize. And I'm just hearing like, it's like a new gift or something that you're going to realize that you have. For some of you guys, you're going to have assistance from someone that you're really close to and that you really trust. And this person is going to help you with this specific gift that you have. And for a lot of you guys, it's going to take off in the spring. Okay, something is really going to take off in the spring for you. Like for real, for real. And your ancestors is backing this up too. Your ancestors came out. The ancestry. So, I mean, they are definitely backing, you know, what this is. For some of you guys, you do got an offer coming towards you. You do got some kind of offer coming towards you. So if you in need of some money, something is coming towards you, I'm seeing. So don't need to worry about that. Because I'm just feeling like somebody could be like really worried 
about finances or something like that and you don't need to be worried about that everything gonna be you're gonna be all right i'm hearing that somebody could be panicking i'm just feeling like somebody could be panicking or something okay somebody may get invited at some kind of uh event okay so somebody may get asked out to go on an event with someone okay Ooh, this may include a travel so somebody may invite you to some kind of event where you're gonna have to travel to go because they don't want to be by themselves at this event and they want you to be there with them okay and for some of you guys while you at this event there could be some changes that's gonna occur all right some good changes okay So, yeah, I'm just seeing a, a professional individual ask somebody to, like, uh, go on, go to an event with them out of town. Yeah. All right, now, y'all, look. <laughs> All right, so somebody could love drinking their coffee. Somebody love their damn coffee. for the collective yes yeah, so I'm hearing whatever you're seeking you're gonna find it you gonna find it we got Capricorn we have boy shorts Somebody got small feet. Current energy. Current energy. We have big chess. We have CEO. Dark eyes, right arm tattoos. We have Q, M, brown skin tone, nose piercing, dark skin tone, Sagittarius. Somebody love wearing durags, Chevy, no kids. We have Y, someone could love wearing heels. TV series, Love Jeans, RV. We have V, 50s, something to do with a Pisces or somebody could be a life path number three. Workaholic, no beard. Somebody could be real thick as well. Okay. Something about the Marines. I heard Marines. I heard military. All right. I heard Vincent. I heard McMurray. Okay. I heard McKinley. Okay. Something with McDonald. I heard Vanessa. Something about veneers. Okay, maybe somebody could have just made an appointment for some veneers, something about veneers. Okay, I heard Yaya, I heard Yamia, Yandy. Okay, I heard Vermont, 
I heard Mississippi. I heard Virginia. Okay, something about Virgil. I heard Virgil. Okay. I heard Yasmin. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. I really hope these messages helped you of some shape or form. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.